Okay, so it's been a few days since my last update. Uh, the tank seems to be cycling nicely. I've started to see some nitrites and nitrates when I test the water, and that's pretty cool. I, I didn't really expect to see the concentrations of nitrites um, climb so fast. I've only been cycling for about a week and a half. Um, that was when I, you know, first dosed the ammonia to the water, and since I've read that it takes you know, six weeks or more for the cycle to complete. I didn't expect to see it happen so quickly. Um, so hopefully in another week or two, um, those levels will be down to zero and I can start thinking about putting some fish in here. And so I'm kind of excited about that. Um, you know, I did use Tetra Safe Start and I know a lot of people think that those bacteria in a bottle products are useless, but I don't know seems like it might be helping me out although those bacteria could be coming in on the plants that I've um, put in here but I don't know doesn't make much difference to me I'm just looking forward to putting some fish in my tank but my plants are doing pretty nicely I think for the most part um, my Anubias are looking very nice and green and healthy so that's pretty cool my hygrophila is also looking pretty great. It could be a bit redder, um, but I haven't been dosing uh, iron or using CO2. So, um, but I'm not really too concerned about that. As long as it's healthy, I'm, I'm happy. And maybe later on I'll start using iron or something like that to help it out a bit. But the Amazon sword um, over here is doing pretty well. Um, but this one over here. It seems to be doing okay, but it looks like a couple of the leaves, if I get around this side, you can see a little bit better. You can see that leaf there in the back is starting to die a little bit. Um, I don't think I buried it too much. I think part of the crown's still exposed, so I think I'm doing okay there. Um, but maybe it's just adjusting to the substrate and everything, so I'm not too worried about it yet. Um, the water wisteria, though, is starting to not look too good, um, which kind of saddens me a bit because at first it was the plant that was doing the best. Um, seemed to take to my tank a lot more than the others at first, but I'm starting to see some leaves dying, which um, probably isn't too big a deal. I bet it's just... Uh, probably reacting to the elevated levels of ammonia and nitrites in the water, I'm guessing. So maybe once everything evens out, um, it'll start to do a bit better, but I'm, pretty soon I'm going to get in there and um, pluck out those dying leaves so it can conserve its energy a bit. Hopefully it'll survive the cycling. Um, and yeah, so overall things are doing pretty well. Um, looking forward to getting some fish. Oh, and one other thing. I decided to uh, dig up that um, lily bulb that I had buried right here. And it's up here floating around um, in the top of the tank somewhere. I decided to let it float until it um, it sprouts. And so then I'll, so it won't um, have as much risk of just rotting in the substrate. So, yeah. So hopefully it'll sprout soon. If not, no big deal. It was cheap. Um, but yeah, so that's the update. And I guess I'll catch you in the next video. Thanks for watching.